Get away from that man. It's okay, I'm a good guy. You stole the show as Johnny Cash in Walk the Line, and you won us over as Arthur Fleck in The Joker. Quite frankly, Joaquin Phoenix, we can't wait to see what you get up to next. If your fans had it their way, your acting career would be even busier than it is today. If that's even possible, they can't wait to see your IMDb page light up with new productions, like Joker 2. But in the meantime, tell us, what other movies are you working on? Joaquin Phoenix is as unpredictable as Arthur Fleck himself, so there's no way of knowing which movies he'll pop up in. Will he reprise his role as Gotham's most wanted criminal in Joker 2, or will he take on Robert Pattinson's Bruce Wayne in the upcoming movie, The Batman? Keep watching to find out which movies Joaquin is all set to star in, and which films his fans are hoping he'll be cast in. What could be more glorious than to challenge the Emperor himself in the great arena? Joaquin Phoenix has officially been cast in Come On, Come On. In fact, he's already started filming the American drama in New Orleans as of mid-January 2020. Director and writer Mike Mills has cast actor Gabby Hoffman alongside Joaquin, but little else is known about the casting list. According to River Beats, Joaquin will play a documentary filmmaker who's working on a project that centers around gifted children. The actor was spotted on the set of Come On, Come On in New Orleans, dancing with his on-screen nephew in a Mardi Gras parade so we can expect to see him show off his Joker dance moves once again in the upcoming flick. And hopes are high for some new meme-worthy dance scenes. Come On, Come On is slated to come out sometime in 2020. You just have to be boring. That's literally it. As fans imagine Joaquin Phoenix dusting off his brown suede shoes, they find themselves wondering if the actor will be dusting off his old guitar anytime soon. Who could forget when Joaquin portrayed Johnny Cash in Walk the Line back in 2005? His performance was so crisp, it has fans asking for a sequel after all these years. A fan who goes by the handle 3219ATOWN asked for a sequel on Reddit, saying the movie could cover Johnny Cash's life after the events of the original. Although Walk the Line 2 isn't in the works whatsoever, some fans would love to see this movie come to fruition. But who knows, maybe Dewey Cox from Walk Hard will make a cameo. This isn't about a tour, this isn't about a song. The Joker was such a big hit, it immediately had people talking about a sequel. The Joker origin movie grossed over $1 billion and quickly became the best performing R-rated film in Hollywood history. So it's only natural that fans want to see Joaquin Phoenix reprise his role as the good clown gone bad in Joker 2. While there is no clear release date for the possible sequel, let alone a plot, the project has been added to Joaquin's IMDb page. This comes as a surprise to some as the star has openly voiced his disdain for franchises in the past. But with the movie's success, refusing to reprise his role as Arthur Fleck would be a hard thing to do. While co-writer and director Todd Phillips has denied sequel rumors to the point of exhaustion, it looks like he might get on board after all. One of the many reasons The Joker was so entertaining had to do with its Bruce Wayne subplot. And now that Batman has been confirmed, fans are wondering if these two movies' intricate plots will weave themselves together. But according to Todd Phillips, Joaquin's Joker will not star opposite Robert Pattinson's Batman. Even then, fans remain optimistic that Joaquin will join the casting list, as The Batman is slated to come out sometime in 2021. So there's plenty of time to flip the script. Alongside Robert, The Batman stars Zoe Kravitz as Catwoman. Colin Farrell as Penguin, and Paul Dano as the Riddler. Whether or not Joaquin joins the Wicked cast, there's still a good chance that Batman and the Joker will oppose each other in future films. Your mother was delusional. She was a sick woman. Don't say that. Joaquin Phoenix is rumored to be starring in the Casey Affleck's upcoming film, Far Bright Star. The film's release date has yet to be announced, but according to The Cinemaholic, the actor will portray a cavalryman who leads a hunt in 1916 for Mexican revolutionary Pancho Villa. The movie is based on Robert Olmsted's novel by the same name. If Joaquin is cast as the lead, he will portray Napoleon Childs. Oddly enough, Johnny Cash's father, Ray Cash, was involved in the Pancho Villa manhunt in real life, connecting the Walk the Line star to Johnny Cash in a whole new way. You see, I never had to do a hard time like you, although I have on occasion got myself busted.
We don't know about you, but we'd love to see Joaquin Phoenix star alongside Keanu Reeves in an action movie. These amazing actors would be perfect on-screen rivals. If you love the John Wick franchise, maybe you'd be interested in seeing Joaquin and Keanu battle it out in John Wick Chapter 4. The fourth installment is rumored to be making its big screen debut sometime in 2021. And although it's a long shot, we're hoping to see Joaquin's name added to the casting list. Hey, people can dream, can't they? Which upcoming Joaquin Phoenix movie are you most excited to watch? And which movie would you want to see him star in? Sound off in the comments. The slave who became a gladiator. The gladiator who defied an emperor. Movie roles Joaquin Phoenix needs to star in. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more. We'll see you next time on The Things.